Norfolk is well known for its relatively flat landscape, with gently rolling hills and large open areas. However, at the coast, the land becomes a bit more hilly and features some well-defined and important landforms. One of these is Blakeney Esker. Blakeney Esker is a ridge which stretches for three and a half kilometres from the small village of Granford to the coast at Blakeney. The ridge was formed thousands of years ago in the last ice age when a river of meltwater was flowing underneath the glacier. This meltwater carried sand, gravel and chunks of clay and chalk from the surrounding land. This sediment settled as the water flow slowed. As the ice melted, the sediment stayed put, creating this landform. The landform in its current state has been altered by man. The esker was a rich source of sand and gravel, which also meant it was easily dug. This led to several quarries being excavated. Quarrying in the Glavon Valley has been happening for years, with the minerals used in agriculture and road making. However, during the Second World War, quarrying took place on the Esker. This supplied the sand and gravel used in the construction of RAF Langham and other concrete defences. Quarrying took place on the Esker up until the early 1990s, when all the useful aggregates had been extracted. The site at Wiverton Downs, now a local nature reserve and picnic area, is situated on the southeastern end of the Esker. Several pits were excavated here until the site's closure as a working quarry in the late 1980s. You can still see exposures displaying the different grades of shingle varying with the depth. This makes the pits very interesting for geologists, as these exposures contain vital information on how the esker formed. Further west along the esker is another disused pit, just off Langham Road, on the outskirts of Blakeney. This has now been converted to a small industrial unit for local plumbers, Scargills. The Esker reaches its highest point above sea level at Kettle Hill in Blakeney. The northwestern section of the hill was also excavated for quarrying. The exposures here show a lot of flint. North of the A149 coast road which crosses the Esker is privately owned and the ridge slopes down into the salt marshes below. As well as along the Blakeney Esker, there are many pits and quarries throughout the Glaven Valley. This large disused pit at Bilsey Hill, just outside Lyham, is now designated as a site of special scientific interest, or SSSI. Privately owned and now overgrown, the scrub is starting to cover the 20 metres deep exposures. One of the pits in the Glaven Valley, which is still in use today, is just outside Glanford at Walsley. Operated by Glaven Pits Limited, it extracts mainly sand, but it is also used for storing Category 1 inert waste. Another sand pit still in use is just outside Saxingham on the V1156. This is privately owned and has undergone a bit more development recently. Various other disused pits and quarries can be found all over this area in Norfolk. Some disused pits are used as landfill sites.